Hey everyone, welcome back from the seminars program. It seems like it's going to be a different semester around here and seminars is no different. Though we went back to the drawing board, are feeling really excited about what we're going to be offering this semester. Specifically, the ways that we're hoping to take the content of our seminars and engage campus thoughtfully and creatively towards justice. We took the spirit and DNA of our Appalachia seminar and created a new seminar called People, Land, and Community that I'll hope you consider. And we're also gonna be offering two different sections of Act Justly, our racial justice seminar, focused not only on the history of the fight for racial justice, but what that means for us today, not only in our nation broadly, but also on our campus and in our campus community. So I hope you'll consider joining us this semester. Have a great transition back to campus. We can't wait to see you soon. Hello. Welcome and happy fall semester. We hope you're doing well. My name is Melissa Marley Bonnickson and I'm the Director of Leadership Formation. Our work here in the Center thinks about what do 21st century leaders for the common good need. We have a program called Better Together Notre Dame and it looks at interfaith cooperation. We welcome any student that's interested in an interfaith conversation, whether that's about your own story or your interest in someone else's story. We'd love to gather you together in small groups to think about what does it mean to be an interfaith uh, leader who works for the common good in the 21st century. So if you have any desire to have an interfaith conversation and think about cooperation and leadership, we would love to see you here. Hi, I'm Ben Wilson, the director of the Summer Service Learning Program, or the SSLP. With some COVID-19 related changes for the SSLP 2021, students next summer will be paired with an SSLP site in their hometown, uh, for which they'll provide full-time service for eight weeks. Students will also receive a $3,000 scholarship and three credits. It's a particularly great opportunity for first year students and it's open to all years. You can apply starting November 1st and please hope stay tuned on our website for more details coming soon. Thanks. Hi students, I'm Rachel Thomas Morgan, Director of International Summer Service Learning Program. Last summer, due to COVID, we were not able to send students abroad, but over half of our students were able to engage with international partners around the world, teaching English to over 130 students in Ecuador, working on social entrepreneur projects with teams in Guatemala, and working on community-based learning projects with vulnerable populations in Senegal. For 2021, we hope to be able to send students abroad. If that is not the case, we will be able to bring ISSLP online with the opportunity for you to work with communities around the world. If there is anything we learned from this global pandemic, it's that international cooperation and collaboration is ever more important. Hello, my name is Lulu Moyo and I am the Community Engaged Learning Assistant Program Director here with the Center for Social Concerns. I am one of the newer members of the team as I joined in March, so I'm so looking forward to meeting with you. A great opportunity that I was a part of this summer was working on the Engaged Learning Forums with community partners. If you are wondering about what we were able to achieve with that, please head on over to our website and explore all our video content that follows up from those events. I look forward to hearing from you. Hi everyone, my name is Dave Lassen and I'm the Community Engaged Learning Program Director at the Center for Social Concerns. This summer I've had the great fortune of working with a lot of community organizations here in the South Bend area and I can tell you that they are excited to be working with students again. So I'd encourage you to go to our website, go to our Community Partner Directory and find the spreadsheet there that lists a lot of projects that you can still engage in while keeping a safe physical distance and still contributing to the health and well-being of our local area. Thanks everyone. Hi. This is Dan Graff, director of the Higgins Labor Program at the Center for Social Concerns. Rooted in the Catholic social tradition's commitment to the dignity of labor, the Higgins Labor Program pursues all questions related to work, the politics of work, and the work of social justice. Most of our programming will be online this fall, and I encourage you to check us out. Talks, panel discussions, research initiatives like the Just Wage Project. Please visit Higgins Labor Program and get involved. Thank you.